This woman has 44 kids, all from one father. And believe it or not, she gave birth to them before turning 40 years old. How is this humanly possible? Is she somehow addicted to pregnancy? Giving birth on the first time, she was very scared because she was like, what is happening? But as it kept on coming on, she kept on moving on. Or is there a surprising reason why she can't stop? This is Mariam, also known as Mama Uganda, a woman who became famous exactly because of her extraordinary ability to give birth to so many kids. What's the best thing about having so many siblings? You can't be bored when you have many brothers. Sometimes it's, it's bad, but we cooperate and we love each other. They all live in a beautiful compound as if they have a village of their own. Over here is the bathroom. You walk in here, one here, one here. There's a big 5,000 liter water tank right there. This is the local kitchen. You're cooking every day for all these kids. Mm. So they eat three times a day, morning, lunch, and supper. And you have no help? No, she Really? She but as I learned more about the real reason she got to this point, I was heartbroken. Turns out she's been giving birth since she was as young as 13 years old. She believes her father sold her because she, he was given cows, goats, and money. So it's like she was sold off. <laughs> oh, she was sold off? Yeah. Just so the father could... Yeah, get those. Did he treat you well in your marriage before he left you? Was he at least nice to the kids? Was he nice to you? The man was 45 years, and for her she was 12 years. So obviously there was no... Yeah, there's no kind of love. It's like a forced marriage, so there was no good relationship. So the 45 year old yeah. married the 12 year old. Yeah, and the guy had five, four other women, so she was the female. And since that forced marriage at 13, her body just kept on producing different sets of quintuplets, triplets, and twins. So she has uh, three, five times, five, five times, two, five times, then one is the last bone. So she has 15 pair of twins. All of whom she feeds three times a day and takes care of when they're sick. Uh, most of the time she buys the drugs and keeps them and also she gets local herbs and boils them. But looking at her situation, it's obvious they are struggling. The most difficult thing, school fees is too expensive. Yeah, and for now we are too because of school fees. So why can't she just take birth control pills and stop? They told her if she doesn't give birth to those uh, kids or to those eggs, she will have those uh, fibroids. The fibroids will damage her um, uterus. Got it. Yeah, and she will not be able to survive for a long time. And when I asked where the father of the 44 children was, why is he not here helping raise the kids? The main reason actually why the man abandoned her because that she produced a lot. Most men of here in Africa, they don't like taking care of their kids. They take care of them when they have grown up. It's very unfortunate that a man would irresponsibly leave a mother like this. But as I spent more time with Mama Uganda, my pity instantly turned into a lot of respect. We actually brought you a lot of stuff. She's so happy for the food that you have brought for her. Actually, she, it, the food will take some months, like two months. Because despite the hardships of raising 44 kids all on her own, working three jobs as a single mom, she is happy and she is proud of her extreme motherhood. It's crazy when you see her walking with all of her kids. There's like so many of them behind her. She holds hands with them. And everyone is happy, super, super happy. <laughs> Mama Uganda is a true legend and an absolute warrior. And she is a great proof that mothers simply have the strongest hearts in the world. If you could say one message to mothers out there, how to be a better mother, what advice would you give them? All the mothers out there, you should learn how to take care of your children because a child is never a mistake. Even if a man abandons you, at least the little you have, you can share with your kids.